Welcome to Modern Energy Art and today I'm really glad to have you here because I'd like to tell you the story how Modern Energy Art came into being. This all began on a blustery October day in 2003 when I was very distraught and tired. i just moved house after all kinds of cataclysms in my life and I'd come to the conclusion there was no point in going on. I was not just depressed, I was so destroyed I actually had slid down a wall and was sitting on the floor and contemplating putting an end to it all. And I'm not being overly dramatic here, it was really as bad as that. And I was just sitting there and just staring at the blank wall in that new house and all of a sudden I saw up in the corner, in the right hand corner, a little tiny light spot dancing around on the wall. And it was the most remarkable, amazing grace type experience as I was watching this light spot. And all the tiredness and all the weirdness and all the misery and depression just, it just went somewhere, God knows where, and I was just fascinated by this light spot. And I saw it and I thought to myself, it is writing a message for me. And as I thought that, I had a, a total enlightenment experience on how everything moves through space in its own time and it leaves this trail behind. And the trail that it leaves behind is really the message, the story of its life. And it doesn't matter if that's a leaf on a tree or a tree itself or a person walking through life, moving through life, as well as, this came later, the trails that we deliberately make in the sands of time. But So there was the aspect, staring up at this little light spot, moving, dancing and writing its message in living light, as it were. And there was this enormous outburst of energy, and I jumped up, I ran up the stairs, dug around in the packing crates that were still completely unpacked and I found an old canvas and I found a pen I ran back downstairs and praying that the light spot was still there and it was and I went and climbed up on a chair and held the canvas up and then traced the path of the little light spot and after a few traces it disappeared and it had gone. And later on it turned out that this light spot had been created by a little mirror ball I had hung up on the washing line. And at that very moment of my deepest darkest depression the sun had moved around and struck it exactly so that it would produce that light spot on the ceiling that the aspect saw and which gave her this amazing revelation about the nature of movement and the universe. Um, when I got the canvas down, I saw that the lines were intersecting and they were just asking to be coloured in in some way. But I didn't have any paints. So I looked around and I found a small toolbox, toy box from my young son who was painting World of Warcraft figures at the time and there were some little paint pots in there and these paints were Space Wolves Grey, Gore Red, Bleached Bone White <laughs> and Mithril Silver. And so I didn't have a brush either so I took a kitchen sponge and dabbed on the paint with the edge of the kitchen sponge to fill in these pieces. And so here we have this piece and it is Mirable messages made on the 3rd of October in 2003 and with a kitchen sponge <laughs> and World of Warcraft paints. Yes, and there it is. And that would be the very first piece of modern energy art as I come to think of it that was ever created. It gave the movement lines of the time and it gave this thing of knowing how to colour in these segments and even if you only have a choice of these few little colours there's one that will be brighter than any other 
and the click that produced so as well as then the background as well and how the whole thing works it was all there in this one experience and that was terribly exciting to me it was wonderful but then a few days later the second part arrived and that was when I went to an artist friend's studio and he was a lovely guy but he'd been painting the same picture for at least 15 years or more. He'd been sexually abused by a priest as a young man and so the picture that he kept painting over and over and over again was a, a self-portrait of his face and Christ on the cross forming his eyebrows and his nose and these became ever more bleeding and disturbed and scary and black and red as time went by and it also became bigger so on this day when I walked into his studio he had a huge big canvas there and he was stabbing at it yet again with that same picture that he'd been painting over and over and over again and on that day I just walked in and I saw it and I shouted at him my god you've been painting the problem for all this time how about you paint the solution and he said ah, the solution I wouldn't know how to paint that and I said well I don't know I mean if the solution had a color what color would it be and he just, his eyes just went huge and he went, blue, it would be blue. And he threw that old thing off the easel and got a new canvas and he, I was completely forgotten. As he was running around trying to find blue and matching the right shade of blue, that was the start of the solution for his problem. And I'm happy to say this artist never looked back and he never ever painted that horrible self-portrait ever again. And I had been given the enormous gift of art solutions. So now, combining these two things, this movement that defines us through time and space, and asking for our totality, our energy, mind, our soul, whoever is listening, to guide us towards a solution using these art solutions paintings, these symbol paintings that we call them, that was just an extraordinary discovery and for many, many, many months I made hundreds and hundreds of symbol paintings to address some of sort of the core issues that I felt I had with my life. Give me the solution. We know what the problem is. Now I want to move forward. I want the solution. And the energy experiences of that were absolutely extraordinary. I mean, just the when you're starting doing the lines and it is focused on the problem that you're working with, the solution that you are seeking, there is energy tingles and flows all through your body. Ideas are popping up in your mind here, there and everywhere and start to connect up with each other. And because the whole thing takes quite a long time to finish completely, it is such a focused, concentrated time on the solution to your problem is spent, that it far surpasses any therapy hour or sitting about in meditation for a short period of time. Art Solutions, Modern Energy Art Solutions is an extraordinary form of not just energy healing, not just energy healing, but actually creating reality. <laughs>